Hello, hello. Just getting back into this. I'm trying to start streaming again daily. I mean, not daily. I'm not doing that shit yet. But um, I'm going to start trying to stream more consistently again. You know, I say this all the time. You know people say this crap. But uh, let's type on chat just to see if it works. It takes a while, but I need to figure that out. I need to make it like a, a layout thing so that it looks nicer. But um, yeah, I definitely need to try and get back into it. That's one of my goals is to uh, try and get it on a better schedule, you know? All right, so let's switch the monitors actually. I wanna put this over here. And then I'll put this over here. Yeah, I was supposed to do Final Fantasy 7 today, but I'm a bad boy. But at least I'm doing something, right? It's a positivity. Okay. So I figured I could do some raid for today, just to kind of get me back into doing this. Oh, hello, son. How are you? How have you been? But yeah, so I'm going to try and get back into, you know, my stream dates, which is Monday and Thursday until I say otherwise. So even though I didn't stream at six, like I'm supposed to, and I'm not playing Final Fantasy like I was planning on, at um, least I'm on, right? So let's just figure out what I want to do. Just going to kind of tinker around, like I said in the thing, I'm just chilling. Wait, why did it not? That's all I got to say. Fair enough, fair enough. Why does it say Mario? It shouldn't say Mario. Okay, now it says the right thing. Why the hell? Um, fair enough though. You know, I get it. I, you know, COVID sucks. I can't blame you for being upset about it. It's honestly been frustrating. I think for so many people, I've had a very frustrating year in general, but yeah, COVID is not helping. I must say though, I was having a pretty crappy year before COVID. So COVID is just kind of the cherry. It's like, oh, thank you. Kicking me in the nuts. I appreciate it. I needed that in my life. Get rid of all this crap. I don't need any of that. Okay, I don't use any of those sets, so let's get rid of that, and then let's get rid of anything else. What's up, Brag? How you doing? Look at all this crap, man. I forgot to clean this out when I did some dragon. Look at the six-star chest. How depressing, but it's a flat, and I, I rarely use a flat. All useless. Very useless. <sighs> so right now I'm in rebuilding mode in this game. You know, I've been all over the place. Doing alright, man. Doing alright, just trying to balance out my life, you know. Trying to play a bit less raid. Uh, at least during the daytime. You know, and then focus on other stuff. Let me just send that to this person. Okay. But yeah, you know, just trying to balance everything out. Trying to find that happy medium, you know, between streaming, spending time with my wife, uh, cooking, cleaning, you know, playing raid, which I think I got a little too addicted to. I think I've said it before. We tried Binding of Isaac pretty fun also this is my second time watching this and I'm all in watching what raid or just you know me and binding of Isaac I don't think I've heard of it I'm trying to debate what I want to do I guess I should 
I can descend her real quick. Might as well, right? Yeah, bro. I got... I was playing it non-stop. Having multiple accounts, you know. And I was playing it all the time. Even when I'm chilling on the couch with my wife. And that ain't cool. If I'm gonna be honest. You know, you shouldn't be like that. So now I'm trying to play less. You know, I only log on for my clan boss keys during the daytime. And then at night, when we're chilling, and, and that's when I do the chill, talk, and chat, all that stuff. Aside from that, my clan mates need me. I have Discord with them, you know, so there's no need. Oh, I have a Lego book. I didn't know this. Hold on. Hmm. Popped in a couple times already. So you might like it. It's like an RNG dungeon game. Resets each run. Each run is its own story. Hmm. What's it? What, um... Where do you play it? What, what is the port? The labeling. How do you say that again? What well, platform? That's the sentence. Okay, we got a Lego book and a Epic book. We have a bunch of stuff to use it on. Am I working on you? No, not working on you. Not working on you? No. Nope. Who the hell am I working on? I want to say all of you are done. But let's check you for, we'll check you. I know you're done. I know you two are done. I know you're done. You're done. Maybe you. And we'll check you. And you. We'll, ch we'll check all this. Console your preference, to be honest. I tend to prefer console because I, I uh, I say it all the time, but my wife is literally everything to me. So anything I decide to do is something I want to do at least near my wife. So if I'm playing something on console, she can be a part of it with me. Whereas PC, she can't as much because I like she'd be on the couch. I'll be on my computer. We're not we're separated. But if I'm playing it on the console, she can watch it, be on her phone a little bit and she can, you know, be a part of it. Although she is getting more into PC stuff. So that's exciting. I'm going to probably stream on Monday, next Monday, uh, Fall Guys with her. We're going to have a nice little session of that. Okay, uh, let's go back to Tavern here. Oh, I've started you. Okay, so let's work on him because Big Gun will be useful for me at some point. Plus, I should build my Ogre in better because I'm close to winning it or beating it. And I want to get that going. Oh, I didn't finish you. Well, there you go. Okay. Okay, so now that I know, I'm going to leave him out. I'm going to leave her out. Everything else. Okay. Everything else is going to go away. And with these new bot lists. Yeah, I heard about those. That's good, though. I'm glad it helps out. You can run co op on it. it. Makes it a little harder because you share your life points. I'm guessing that's life points or help, you know, health. But it makes it fun, to be honest, because you can sometimes get some cheesy exploits. I'll definitely look into it. I'm always looking for a fun game. And if it's co-op, it's something I can play with my wife. That's always, you know. Oh, man. Damn. So my sister got Texas to Brazil. Wow. She sent, she sent me pictures right now. She got it sent to her. And apparently it's still hot and everything. But, um, hold on. Give me a second. Let me write that down. Actually, I'll, I'll just send a text to my wife. Give me a sec. I'm just going to send her a text of that. Uh, what was the game again? Let me go back up. Oh, Finding of Isaac. I'm always looking for fun games. And if it's a, uh, like a fun little game that I could play with my wife or something, even better. Because later on down the line, I might split my stream into three. Right now, it's only two streams a week. Because that's what me and my wife agreed upon would be okay without taking away from our marriage and, and relationship. But later on, I may want to try and split to three once I get all my other uh, responsibilities under control. Let's let's put it that way. That's a good way to say it, right? You know, where I got the habit of cooking and cleaning properly done so that I don't let it pile up, all that kind of stuff. But once I do, one of my three streams, I want to be with my wife. So I definitely would like more co-op games so that she can be a part of it. You know what I'm saying? 
Yeah, I was stuck in Silver 2 for a while. Was able to get my mission done. Yeah, I know. I I've been hearing a, a lot of my clanmates were in Silver 2, Silver 4 range. And now they're able to be in Gold. Um, th Wait, who is this? Oh, Sinesha. Okay, whatever. Move to Vault. Okay, so... We'll keep... Did I put him back? Oh my god. Get your fat ass back outside. And you get back up. get back outside. So any books I get uh, that are epic or legendary will go towards those two. Oh no, I forgot about you. I should probably be working on you. Or are you done? Oh wow, you're done. I should be working on him more. Jesus. Okay, so I need blue. I can do four. I really need to build him because he's good and I just ignore him constantly. By 30%. That's pretty good. And grants an extra turn. That's so obnoxious. He has a champion for 20%. When hit. Wow. Could you believe that I ignore? Yeah, he is adorable, isn't he? I ignored him for so long. I got, look at all these books. I don't even know what to do with them. I'll build some crappy rares later, like my my uh, clan leader. He does that. Do I have any keys? I need another two hours. Who's hitting brutal? Oh, okay. Well, he's allowed. I'm just kind of checking the state of the of our clannies here. Oh, this person got it underway. This person has been trying to get this team to work, so their keys were like five million. I was determined to say mill, and then I gave up. In case you're wondering why I sounded like a moron. Okay. And then I am down here. I need one more key, which I'm going to get later. Did I have one key? Okay. Hopefully I'll get another uh, Lego book or two. I'll just do this one. I'm gonna leave it on auto while I just chill here with you all. Let's still mill off three king nightmare today. You're getting there though. You still using the team that I helped you set up, or you you uh, tweaked it a bit? Same team, works well. That's good. I'm gonna... I can't remember. Well done. While this is running. Bless you, gorgeous. Okay, while this is running. Let me go on Discord real quick. Let me go look for you real quick. Just because I'm kind of curious as to where we left off and what you're... Does it not show you? I'm gonna go this way. Oh, there you are. Oh, yeah, because you have Valkyrie, right? Yeah, you should easily three key and potentially two key when we get, um, when you get some better gear. You mind telling me what your Valkyrie's defense is at? If you if you know it about the top of your head. Bro, you need to kill her first. What's up, Bubba? Oh, it's a game. Uh, someone was telling me to check out that game. Oh. And I said it could be co-op. So I figured I'd, you know, jot it down. Yeah. 
Oof, this is gonna be a loss. I didn't pay attention. Cause you need to attack her, cause she can res. All right, let's end this now. Jizzo, there's no point. Replay. The one thing I like is that with the faction war keys, they don't let they don't make you lose them. I need to rebuild both of these guys. They can be doing a lot better than they are. Hmm, there's no need. We'll just go. Just go a little by little here. There's no point in uh, wasting um, valuable moves. Point six. For Valkyrie, your goal. I mean, ideally you want seven thousand defense, but um. At the very minimum, you want to want to go for five point five, for her. I mean, four point six is awesome. I'm not saying it's not or anything, but for Valkyrie, t she tends to be high on defense, like anyone that has her. So that should be like a mini goal for you. Or is your team speed tuned? Tuned. Jesus. Speaking is a problem sometimes. Yeah, it's on PC. Actually, I'm playing it on PC right now. That's how you see my mouse. I usually play it on my phone, but for the purpose of streaming, you know. Okay, let's put you in counterattack and let's provoke you if it works. It did work. Hey man, if you need any tips, let me know. I forgot, you have my number, don't you? Mr. Naruto Sage. And while your team isn't speed tuned yet, and you're doing three keys, then you already know, dude. It's going to do even better. That's awesome. That just means it's going to get even better. Well, think about that as a huge positive. You can use your keys on Nightmare, and that's not even the best it could do, you know? That's awesome to hear. I forgot your... Yeah. Um, I forgot, Rag, are you... What was I thinking? My brain. Are you still using uh, Coffin Smasher as your attack down? Cause that's yeah that's another thing that you can change later as you get a better version you know sepulcher being probably the best of the epics but you could use tayrell sepulcher jarig or jrig whatever you call them so yeah man that's awesome i'm happy to hear and i'm glad i was able to help you you know i, I like to try to help people honestly i'm holding this for nothing let me just use it because i'm getting slowly beat here if i keep eating crap Alright, let's, uh, let's, let's try to kill these people here. There we go. That's going to get good. Can you stop? Stop. Giant douche. Okay. Yeah, they nerfed Draco quite a bit when it comes to his A1. Oh, nice. You pulled it or no? You're going to save it? Are you going to wait for like a times two event or are you going to wait for a times 10 or are you going to wait until there's at least a champion summoning event? Because those are the three types that you would save for. Okay, let's go for you. Let's do this. Perfect. Um, hmm it on you. Okay. 
Okay, now we can weaken. Since the time two just passed, you're going to wait a while. The only reason I would suggest that in your case you don't need to do that yet is that you're missing epic still. If you know what I mean. So, I still say if you want, you could pull them. But obviously, you know, it's your prerogative if you want to save them. That's okay. You know, there's nothing wrong with that. And I'll show you what I mean. Yeah, that, that happens to me. Like, I'll show, you, I'll show you my stock right now of all the crap I need to work on. And I've been just so bad. Let's go with you. Let's go for you. Okay, and then this should kill you. Perfect. All right, on a sec, I think it can auto the rest. Honestly, it's one of those things that I've gotten just as many legendaries not holding them for times two than I have four times two. And not to say that's, you know, that you should do that or shouldn't. It's just one of those like, things you know but yeah so like when you see all the epics i have like now yeah holding um the sacreds would be better just gotta lower to six stars and i've been slacking for that yeah i do that all the time dude look at all these legendaries that are 50 i need to level them up but i've been so lazy and then I got all this crap. And I got him I need to work on. Right. Like he has no masteries. And uh, no books. Him you just saw. I need to put books and masteries. Him I need masteries. Her I need both books and masteries. Zavia same thing. Elenaro I just got her. Vizier number three. Freaking vizier. I got three of them. I hate that. I hate them. And then, you know, obviously the most important thing. Uh, let me show you. Let me show you the best thing. I gotta find it. Where are them? Oh, there they are. And then I got four Galax at level 60 because that is who I am as a person. And for anyone that doesn't know, Galax is one of the four starters. And he's also the worst starter that you can pick. But obviously, I didn't know that when I played. And then I was like, you know what? He's my favorite. I don't care. And I made four of them. Because. Just because. And you know what? He deserves to be loved. I don't know why people hate him. He's beautiful. All right, back to this. Oh, I can put. Ooh. What are your skills? Freeze. That's the only skill you have. I guess I'll do accuracy until I get a resist. Oh, wait, I have a resist. Okay, let's get this to at least 12. Yeah, but Elaine hits better and has more AoE attacks. Aetho has, you know, she can make herself stronger and then her AoE hits harder, I think, than Galax. And then obviously Kale's the best. I, th I think that's more or less undisputed. Some people like to argue that Elaine's better, but I disagree. Kale's way too useful everywhere versus Elaine's, you know, some uses. But honestly, you know, I had Gallic and he never steered me wrong. Don't get me wrong, he's not the best, but he's still better than most rares. I'd like to stay over a million, please. Por favor. Uno más. One more. Don't do this to me. Oh. Well, we got a bit. We got a bit. Okay, good. 
Ooh, two one to crit damage. This is actually going to be useful. Which also means he might he might not stay with it because I don't know if I want him to be damaged. No, I've never used. I, honestly, I really should build one of each so that I can see what they do. Do I have them? No, I ate them all. I always end up eating everything. Right now, a mini goal is to get potions. I need to get a ton of potions. So I'm going to be doing a lot of blue, a lot of white. We got one more minute until the reset. Oh, I get a void. Come on, I'm going to open that on stream. I still don't save. Also, for those uh, that are wondering, I am. I don't spend like I used to. I only spend on two things the raid pass and uh, $10 for the gems. This one. Because those are decent value. You know, it's actually a great value. I'm not going to say anything on that. You know, so. If anything, I'd say the gem pass is the most. Uh, you know, valuable thing. Raid pass I get just because the 100 battle passes are kind of useful to me. Oh, I have a key. I forgot I could use this. Oh, no, yeah, there are other good buys, like the energy packs and stuff like that. But right now, I'm not spending in this game. Let's see. Let's see if we get an uh, epic, at least. Nope. Got another ox. <sighs> hmm, let's see what I want to do first things first what are the faction wars now barbarian and skinwalker these are actually my worst right now right they're the only two in the 30s yeah 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 he sucks okay so let's uh, get started with some of the tasks here for the what do you call it the dailies there for all, anyone that's new or doesn't actually play there are dailies obviously i mean if you guys played almost any game they have dailies and uh they're almost always the same there's only one that changes might as well get rid of some of this fodder all right, so I did the level three times. I need to buy something from the shop. You're cheap. Uh, level one artifact. Let's see if there's anything worth bothering with. Let's see if there's a speed crit rate. Hmm. Let's get you to 12. Wait, no, 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 that's not what I want to do. Really? How far are you in? Thirty six stars tied with Oryx Dark Oryx. That's not bad. Oh, it went to crit rate. It's kind of weak, though. I mean, it's not a bad piece. It's just at a certain point, you start looking for great pieces, not decent pieces. You know what I mean? Speaking of which, let's see what we have here. This one, 17. Okay. I think I have... Two five pieces. I'm not going to use that on those though. Alright, so we got that one. So we did three so far. Let's do Arena. Refresh page. That's fine. Oh, 
Oh, I'm way faster. Rip. All right. This team I might lose, but it doesn't mean I'm not going to try. That's one thing I've noticed. If if I don't try, then I don't know if I'm going to win or not. I'm going to manual this one, actually. Okay. That's, um, I need to make sure Arbiter dies. Okay. And now I'm good. Pretty much, I have a skull crown in to counter their skull crown. Because if she wipes my entire team, she lives because of the passive, just like hers live because of the passive. I say hers, but it's, I don't know who this is. This could be a problem. Let's see. It really just depends on who's faster. If I'm faster, she's screwed. Oh, we'll see, look. Right there. And that is the cause of their demise. I mean, I'm, I think what I should do one day is test out a tanky team so I can show you guys how to survive a speed team. Because there are ways to do it. It's just not as coveted. People don't do it as much. You either whine and mope that you can't beat, uh, you know, fast teams, have a torment, or you do a tanky team. This is an interesting mix. Let's see. I'm faster. Uh, you should start with Kale. This guy right here. You see this? The, the guy, the time marker here has. I could tune the spell kind of sexy recently. Need to gear them some more on their arena ready. And where, where are you in arena? Uh, you said you were in gold one. I think for gold, you want your speed in the 280s to 300 range. Obviously, the higher, the better. If you're going for speed. If you're not going for speed, then obviously you go for whatever you can. At least in gold one, you can farm the tokens. So that, that's at least a benefit. Obviously, you want to get to... You know, as high as you can, so you can get four tokens versus one. But it's still something. I'm not gonna lie, this has been an easy, like, run through. Might as well finish the page, or at least try to. Don't res her. Been using a defense team for a while. What's the team? Honestly, I never fight Hegemons, but whatever. I hate them passionately. Because they automatically go first. Look, and then they lock everything. Alright. Let's see. Okay. And then I go. So now you Sandlash, Lead, Valk, Ghostborn, and Abyss. Ooh. That should be fun. I'm assuming that speed teams can have some trouble with that. I'm gonna look at them individually after this. Um let me finish this page first, and then I'm gonna actually look that up. Now, I plan on getting off at 8.30 my time, so that's 22 minutes for any of you that's not from this time zone. So, I'm just going to do a, like a little hour stream, like I said, you know. Don't, I knew it. Now you're going to just prolong the charade. And now you're going to res her. Unless you die, okay. I'll take that. I mean, that sounds fun. Unfortunately, I have one of those four. I don't have a best. Ghostborn or Valk. I wouldn't mind Valk. Should be fun to play with. 
That's the other thing. I don't need anything now. It's just about collection and testing things out for fun. You know, like I'm, I'm at as far as I'm going to be in the game. Oh, nice. So let's look those champs up just because I'm curious. Might as well show the people. So we got the orc, this one. She sat in my vault for so long. And then I found out her abilities and I'm like, wow. I actually made a video of her about her and how she's better than double counter. Like, instead of running double counter, just run her. So she has an ally protect and a block damage buff on one turn. Like, if, where is it? if an ally HP drops below 50%. This is pretty good. Oh, defense aura, always good. And this one right here is the best move. Three turn cooldown. And freaking hits everyone, decreases the duration of all enemy debuffs. Um, a buff, sorry. And increases the ally buffs. So you use this with a counter attack. Have the counter go first. And then she extends everyone's buffs. So you get to counter attack for an extra turn. And then her A1, which is not bad either. You know, two turns and adds, uh, does provoke. Turn if this champion has no debuffs. Heals. 15% of the damage inflicted of the champion is under any deal. Ooh, I didn't even read that part. Speaking of which, I have a key. And I decided I'm going to use it because I don't care. So let's use it real quick. Let's show you a, a clan boss battle. Uh, let me show you my real team. Even though it's not going to do well. Where is she? So this is normally my team right here. Uh, unfortunately, I have double green versus blue. So this is not going to go well. Alrighty then. Let's start with some poison. Let's stick that. Let's do this, see if we can get the block. Got the block and the attack down. All right, we'll do this. And then we'll do this. I'm going to go back and look at the rest of his team. By the way, guys. I hate him so much. The blue one is obnoxious as hell. Because look, it puts the accuracy on you. And then you can't do anything. I only focus on using endless sands to work on buffs like Dutch it. Duchess and hits really hard. No, yeah, she, she's good in every aspect. Yeah, because she hits hard. Like, people do not understand how hard she can hit. Yes, it extended. But, yeah, she hits hard. She can extend your buffs, so that's a good thing. That's what I use her for. But, like you said, she's her own champion. And she decreases buffs on people so it's it's not a strip but it does decrease it which is very valuable okay so three two so we got a block okay honestly this is just terrible what a pain all right, let's hope we can extend it. I want to keep the block debuff and the attack down on. You know what? I don't care. Let's do that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, so assuming we don't drop off, that's the damage. I mean, that's the, the limit. I would like this to get to like the three or four rate. Oh, that's nice. Oh, why well, I went back to three. Ally damage absorb her damage immunity for one turn saves the team sometimes too. Oh no, I'm telling you, she's a very solid champ. I get, I agree with you 100%. Which is why I kicked myself when I realized that she was in my vault the entire time. Like I had her. Okay. 
I think we can auto at this point. <sighs> so this, assuming I did it right, should be about 20 to 25 mil. On a Ultra Nightmare. But obviously I could switch it off for Sepulcher or uh, Skull Crusher. And just run double counters instead. But it really depends. Alright, so I'm in the 7 range. I hate his anti, like his accuracy debuff. It's such a douchey move. What did I need? I was at 56 mil, right? So I just need 15 mil. Depending on how long it is. I mean, I don't know. I'll see how long it goes. I really wish they would give me a times four. I think that would be so awesome, wouldn't it? Like, if we could just blitz through it a lot faster. I just realized, though, was that compensation that they gave me, was that their compensation for all the garbage we had to go through? You guys notice how they never give shards anymore? They used to give shards when all the garbage went down, but now they don't even give that. They give you some energy. Almost feels like a slap to the face, but, you know. Ooh, Wesker went live. Spelunky. Yeah. That's the sucky part about pulling and then they do an event and yeah. In my case, I just, I pull them whenever I want and I try, I try not to think about those things because then I'll regret myself. But if it makes you feel better, a lot of my clannies pulled like four each and they didn't get a leg, a legendary, let alone martyr. So, you know, it's, it's all about that. There you go. You got Ava. But, you know, you, you get the point though. Like you, you can't really think about it too li like that. Because honestly, there's no guarantee you're going to get it. And that's something that people need to understand. Like, I've seen a lot of people do the times too ancient. And then they're like, bro, I pulled like 50 shards and I didn't get a legendary. I'm like, do you know what the actual percentages are? Do you know how math works? It goes from 0.5% to 1%. That doesn't mean you're guaranteed anything. So, I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm a math person. That I don't get as irritated as others. You know, I, I if I'm going to pull Ancients in the Times 2 event, it's for the Epics. To be honest, not for the Legendaries. Pull my 50 shards on his stream and got nothing. Yeah. Did you? So you actually did that? How did you get that to go? You just had to ask him or... I mean, I personally would never do that myself, but it is interesting. Oh my god, Warlord. Heal up, bro. Nope. Alright, well, I, I already 3 keyed, so I'm good either way, no matter what happens now. No, I'm just kind of curious as to how far we can go with this team. You want him to log on to the current open shorts on the stream. Hmm. Hey, why not? May I ask, what's the appeal of having someone open them for you? Like, I've always been kind of curious as to why. Oof. I'm not even going to get to 20, am I? Who would have thunk that force is my issue? Um, not force, magic. Sorry.
Oh, I made it to 20. That's not bad. 21. Alright. It's not a bad key. Maybe I'll throw a key to Brutal later. Since I wasted that extra key. Oh, I forgot to check. That should have put me into the... Yeah, that puts me in the three key range. Oh, also... Where is he? Where is he? Fuck this guy. See this guy right here, Italian? Fuck him. He's a little bitch. I told him I'd say that. Hanging out on the stream. I'm watching the pools when I'm playing. While I'm playing. Wait, how do you watch the pools while you're playing? Because isn't his account logged in? Alright, so today it's the seven battles. I need to summon two. I'll just summon a ten. Okay, and then I need seven. I got ten minutes left. Okay, this is what I'm working on. Sell everything, seven bottles. All right, let's do it. Mm, got you. No, I definitely like watching them pop other people's, but I honestly like pulling my own. I mean, for me, that's the biggest ecstasy is to pull them. That's half the excitement. I don't know about anyone else, but for me, it all started with Pokemon. I remember when I was 10 years old, dude, my mom bought me some Pokemon cards, bought me some of those, those little starter boxes, and then some booster packs. Bro, it was the most exciting thing ever to open one and get a hollow, and you get so excited about it. And I think that's probably why I like gotchas, because it reminds me of that. I just got to do it within reason and not spend my damn money like a moron. I recently found out that I had spent over the course of like five years in you know multiple mobile games ten thousand dollars and i'm just like are you freaking kidding like it's easy when you just throw it every now and then and don't realize but when you actually put a real number i'm like that could have been a car or a down payment for one anyways or something man so that's why i'm not spending any more in raid if I can't get something, I can't get it. It is what it is. I have, an, I have enough crap to work on anyways. So, I mean, I do spend my 20 a month on my raid pass and my gems that I said. But aside from that, I'm not spending any more because that bothered me. You know, me and my wife have money issues sometimes. And I'm like, it's because I'm squeezing out money every now and then. 20 is here. I'm like, that bothered me. Like, it made me feel shitty. You know what I mean? So, that's actually going to be one of the main reasons why I'm changing the way I, I do everything. Like, I'm going to be a lot less active in game in the middle of the day. I'm going to be on in the morning real quick, do my CB hits, do my dailies if I need to, if I forgot to do them. Um, and aside from that, I'm just going to play at night, you know, after reset, play for an hour or two, do that. My clan, my clannies, they have my Discord. Um... And my Niner friends, you know, them I talk to after nine, you know, nine my time. And uh, that's just how I'm going to have to do it because I really got to make sure I focus on real life as well as other things I want to do. Like streaming, like, you know, getting my stuff clean. Managed to get the new fragment, dude. Only bought an energy pack. What about with or without the event? I'm trying to spend less on Ray 2. Yeah, it's... <sighs> you get addicted, man. You get addicted to, to to this. And it it's a shame because this game has the potential to be amazing. But Ray the Plarium, like they just they drop the ball constantly. You know? Cause let's be honest, the art is amazing. The systems they have in place are really cool. They would just need a couple more in place, like a, a better duplicate system. They don't have one really right now. And honestly the frags, I don't like the way they're done. 
I gotta head out in five minutes anyway, so might as well talk about that a little bit. So doing a fragment event is okay, but notice they choose the champions. I don't like that. I don't know if anyone else has played gotchas, but the gotchas that I've played, the the fragments are random. Oh, Laura would be amazing. Yeah, that would be really cool. You know? But, like, the fragments used to be random. So, for example, let's let's go to Arena, this. Let's go to the Bazaar. So, you see how they have this, this guy right here? Instead of selling one of him every day and making him a weird 100-day event, what they could have done is put, like, two slots here. And make it random as hell. And if it's a legendary, make it three. If it's a um, an epic, make it five or something. Or make the, the levels different, whatever. And it's randomized. It could be any champion that is an epic or a legendary. That's the way it is in other games. Like, it's just randomized. And then, you know, you can go for the ones you want. But here, they hold all the cards, as they usually do. So when they came up with this, I, I made a video of me venting about it because it, it just bothered me because it's like, you, you're not, this is not how it should be done, you know? And even this was slightly disappointing. This is cool. I'm not going to say it's not, but I would have liked if they had all the sets here, but they, again, they just limited it. But I mean, at least they're interesting sets, but I don't know. <coughs> Might as well do one. Let's see, let's make um let's make a chest. And let's put let's put crit damage on it. Yeah. yeah. Attack percent, crit damage. Eh, whatever. Let's do another one. Ew. Get out of here. Okay, I ran out of material. Well, yeah, I mean, I don't mind the Drex thing, but... Like, they want to make that a, a dedicated thing. But I, I, I like the randomized and that you can refresh it. And then you can focus on who you want. Because that would mean anyone can come in there. Even a counter for some people. But whatever. Uh, I, like I said. Okay, I got three minutes left. Let's, um... We did that. Alright, let's check advanced. By the way, this was a cool feature. I'm glad they added this. Let's do this. Let's see if we can get further in this. Hmm. I don't know if I did anything with these. I don't know if I can win this yet. It is Kawaii Desu. Yata. Yata. I will say that the Doom Tower, not the Doom Tower, um, Advanced Quest was an awesome feature. I definitely think it was it was one of their better features. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, this setup is not bad. I just need to set them up better. But I have two resers, and then I have her with extra reses. I just got to build these three to 60, and then try and build them up a bit more. Well, she's not... I don't know about her. My, my barbarians are not built, just for the record, guys. Just in case you're like, wow, this is sad. Um, I don't have them actually built. Like, none of them are with masteries at all. These are the only level 60s. I didn't do anything. As for Void uh, Doom Tower, I'm, I'm used to calling it Void Tower for the year and a half that it was called Void Tower. But um, that should be an exciting new... F hey, what's wrong? I just moved. Calm down. You good? My dog was a little... was napping. I'm on... Not to get... Can't wait. Need her for Dragon 20. Really? I don't use her for anything. I, I should probably build her. Uh, I think... She can be useful. I just ha I haven't used her anywhere. 
it's one of those things that I got her after I've been playing for a year. You know, so I already have a lot of crap on my account. Plus, I used to spend, so I have a lot of crap on my account. So, it's one of those things that she's she's cool. But I got her at a point where I don't need her anywhere. Weird issue to have. I guess it's a good issue to have, though, right? Okay. I mean, I'm winning. This is probably the only one I do because it's almost 8.30. And like I said, I, I want to get off. I got some dishes I want to get done. And then I want to relax with my wife in the evening. You know, I don't know if these people are actually equipped with, like, gear. She has, like, a heal ability, right? Yeah, she does. Attacks on me two times. That's not bad. Kill you. You res her. She's gonna die. No, man, it's always good seeing you, man. It's funny because I just like met you in the channel and then I was like in a giving mood at the time and I just helped you and now we're like, you know, chilling. I always think it's fun. You know, you can meet people in all kinds of ways. You're not even in my clan or anything. I think my clan's finally full again. It took a while to get it full. I was trying to help my uh, my clan leader build her a clan. It's now a top 1,000 clan. That doesn't sound like impressive, but to me that that is awesome, you know. Because you don't get a, a number if you're under a thousand. So when we were hovering in there, it was kind of cool to do. I'll show you guys after. I don't know where we're at right now because some we had a a guy with 2,000 power leave, so we just got someone a little bit weaker. So, that's a bit of a shame. Can you stop hitting me? Oh, crap. Yep, I'm dead. Tax one enemy. Um, I guess we'll try it. You res the wrong one. He's gonna die. Yeah, I mean, if you like the clan, by all means, you know. I had a clan like that too, where I was on Nightmare. I mean, it was my clan. I, I'm the one that had it. Like, I was the leader. And, um, yeah, that failed. I need to check on those three. All right, so let's see those three real quick. We have, she's a little 50. Wow, she has no gear on her. Neither does she. All right, well. No wonder I'm losing. I need to build them. I mean, at least throw some gear on them, you know. I could probably win that one if I did that. So, I'll probably get that going. Um, but, yeah, it was my own clan. But then, uh, this clan right here that I met. Yeah, see, look, we're in the top 1,000. Um, this clan right here, they got a... They were close to doing Nightmare. I was like, oh, I'll help you out. Because he asked me if I could pop in real quick. And then I got Martyr from from being downing uh, Nightmare with them. I got a Sacred and I pulled Martyr. I didn't realize it was a, a time send event for her at the time. The first time. Yeah. And then I was like, you know, I kind of like getting double chest for Nightmare. <laughs> So I told my clan, like, hey, I gave it to someone else. I gave it to one of my deputies. I said, take a care of it, do what you want. I really don't care. You know, it's already on. It had Ultra Nightmare unlocked because I wailed out and killed Nightmare by myself. And I went to this clan, you know, and the rest is history. Been here for like six months on this clan. And in my clan, I was there for like seven months or eight months. The one I made. I named it Mugiwara Pirates. 
Yeah, man. Well, I mean, if you ever are interested, let me know. If you, let me know, like, if your power, I don't know what your power is at, but if you're, we do have a minimum requirement of like a million or a million five hundred. But if your power is ever, ever gets there, you know, and we have room, let me know. Like, let me know if and when you're interested and I will see about getting you an ours if you want. But yeah. But yeah, right now that's what I'm trying to, uh, I'm trying to make that the requirement now to help keep our standing. So if someone leaves and you're interested, 1.3. So yeah, you'd be right in the realm of what we'd accept. And you already do Nightmare, which is what we want. So, next time there's an opening, if you want, I'll, I'll send you a, a message on Discord if you're interested, all right? And we, it's Nightmare every day and Ultra Nightmare every day. Like, Nightmare is for sure going down every day. There's not even a question. Ultra Nightmare tends to go down because this guy right here, he tends to throw extra keys every day. But yeah, man, I'll, I'll let you know. And with that, guys, I think I'm going to end the stream today. About an hour, and now I'm going to go clean some stuff. You know, it was just like a chill stream, just making sure we get back into it, you know. I want to I wanna make sure to stream every, every uh, week two times. Take it easy, Rag. Um, I won't be streaming Raid as much as I used to, but I'm going to try to squeeze it in every now and then if I end uh, my main streams early. Today, I decided to just make this the stream. But usually I'll be streaming a game right now. It's Final Fantasy 7 is what it should be. And Mario 64. But if I finish either of those streams, you know, by 7.30 or 8. Maybe I'll squeeze in a 30 minute uh, raid video as well. Or raid stream, sorry. Anyways, take it easy guys. And if any of you are watching this on YouTube after, wow. That means you stuck around for an hour to get here. Congrats. Later.